This is the um, wireless code transmitter. Basically, it's just a small AM transmitter um, built on a predecessor to the Electronics Learning Lab from Radio Shack. This is the uh, 1999 uh, 301 Electronic Project Lab. Basically, the same setup, but it, this in in this particular uh, version, you've got a variable capacitor and you've got an antenna coil with multiple taps. Pretty neat. Um, your control is just a variable pot. Um, everything else is kind of the same. You you got more switches, which is great, and uh, you still have your LED array. But anyway, um, so this is a really fun, quick project to do with um, my students. And uh, so what we're going to try and do is build the circuit. Very simple. It has five components and a rat's nest of wires, but really simple to do. Um, you send out pulses of radio energy across this antenna here. It's approximately three feet and you get really good results. Um, real quick, here's the circuit. And um, anyway, you should be able to find this pretty much anywhere. Uh, but it's uh, Project 66, the wireless code transmitter. Works fantastic. And let's turn on my uh, radio down here. And this radio doesn't even have an antenna on it. And uh, we're still getting really good results. So I tuned it to around uh, 900 AM, right around there. Um, and you'll, you'll have to go up and down uh, the band, the entire band, because there's, there's two spots that I found that work pretty well. And as you're doing that, you'll need to click your um, switch right here. So uh, with one hand, you could be tuning the radio. With the other hand, clicking the uh, switch. And you should hear some, some ticking, basically. Once you get a tick, you want to fine tune it here with the tuning knob here, the variable, variable capacitor, and you should get uh, maybe some a tone, perhaps. So let's take a listen. Ooh, we're not getting anything. Hmm. What's going on? I didn't tune it right. Uh, I can't do this with one hand. Hold on. Yeah, you can hear it now. Just gotta tune it back in. So you can hear uh, we're, we're kind of interfering with uh, an existing radio station, but if you tune it a little bit, you'll get a nice uh, squeak out of it. Pretty neat. Now, um, on the oscilloscope, uh, the waveform's pretty cool. Um, we just take your oscilloscope probe and patch it right into the antenna wire. It, there it is. Right into the antenna wire. And leave that ground alone. Just uh, put it somewhere else. And you'll see... Um, let's turn that off. You'll see that there's a regular pattern. And that's coming from the atmosphere. Um, if you hold on to the oscilloscope, you'll also become an antenna. These oscilloscopes, are the probes are very, very sensitive, and you'll see pretty much the same effect. So uh, when I pulse the, um, the switch, when I give it uh, current, it's going to oscillate up and down that uh, antenna, and uh, we'll see an amplitude rise, so AM modulation. And you can see it's uh, pretty clear that that amplitude is going bananas on both ends. So, pretty neat. Um, but those are just, that's just one, one way you could integrate this into the classroom. And uh, it's extremely quick and simple and a lot of fun. Thank you very much.